So I think what is important, and, and this is what Eric has highlighted as well, so uh, the procedure with, with the sending of a formal notification under the general regime of conditionality uh, to Hungary and the assessment of the Hungarian Recovery and Resilience Plan are two separate processes. So this is what we can say uh, on the uh, link with the regime of conditionality. I think it's, uh, it's clear that um, there are a certain number of conditions which are set out uh, in the RF uh, regulation, which Verlet has repeated here um, a certain number of times, which, um, which, um, uh, which um, how do you say, <laughs> you see now my linguistic abilities are really diminishing, which address, uh, which address a whole uh, series of issues uh, to ensure that the political objectives of um, Next Generation EU, and in particular DRF, are met. And, of course, that uh, funds uh, that have been generated through Next Generation EU, i.e. EU funds, are managed um, in the appropriate way. Um, and, therefore, uh, we need to um, ensure that uh, those specific conditions are met before we can uh, approve the RF. Now, the RF is one specific instrument. There are many other uh, programs in the um, in the EU. So let's not let's not confuse let's not confuse the two.